In this episode, you will show how to install Minecraft Bedrock very quickly in three ways. The first is if you already have Minecraft Java, the second from scratch, and the third if you have an Xbox and prefer to use the Xbox app, or if you simply have Xbox Game Pass. Let's get started. First and foremost, the initial method is when you already possess Minecraft Java and have the official Minecraft launcher. In this case, you don't need to install anything extra. You can simply access the regular Minecraft launcher where you typically launch Minecraft Java. In this section on the left hand side, we have the option to navigate to Minecraft Bedrock Edition. By clicking on install, you can proceed with the installation and this will be the Bedrock version. Once the installation is complete, we can effortlessly click on play. We provide confirmation and our game initiates. At this point, we once more permit the Minecraft process and you may observe a window appearing prompting you to log in. Simply click to log in and you're fully prepared. If you are already familiar with Minecraft and prefer to skip the tutorial, you can simply click on this particular option located beneath this button. By doing so, you will be directed to the primary menu where you have the ability to access servers, engage in single player mode and explore additional features. Now, as the second option, you have the hyperlink provided in the description, which directs you to the official Minecraft website. Here, we have the opportunity to purchase Minecraft if we do not already own it. We navigate to Minecraft, select the PC platform, and at this stage, we decide which specific version we wish to acquire. You do not need the deluxe edition. The most affordable version is sufficient. We proceed to complete the purchase, naturally logging in with your Microsoft account to obtain the game. If you already own it, you obviously do not need to perform this step because you already possess the game. Now, in the Windows search bar, you can simply type Microsoft Store. We access this application, which serves as a store for downloading applications. In the top bar, we search for Minecraft. I hit Enter. Now, we see Minecraft with both Java and Bedrock editions. After completing the purchase, you should receive confirmation that you now own the game. If the game is not yet in your possession, the purchase price will be shown here, and if you prefer not to buy it via the website, you should have the option to do so through this store as well. You are currently logged in, as indicated in the upper right corner. However, since I have already purchased the game, I can now click Play on this blue button, and our launcher will open. We also have the option to open it through an alternative method, which involves accessing the list of our available programs here within the store, we can select the Minecraft launcher and either proceed to install it individually or simply open it. Ultimately it amounts to the same outcome. Just ensure that it indicates here that the publisher is indeed Microsoft so you can confidently launch the correct application. It also displays Microsoft here as well. Now indeed, when the launcher is fully open, we find ourselves situated in the Minecraft Bedrock tab which is located here on the left hand side and we have the available option to install Minecraft Bedrock. Alternatively, if it is already installed, you will see the play button here, just like I do, and we can proceed to launch it. As we can observe, our Minecraft Bedrock initiates successfully. Alright, and the third alternative is to gain access via the Xbox application, which will also function if you possess a Game Pass subscription. In this scenario, purchasing the game is unnecessary, you can simply utilize Game Pass. So, within the Windows Search functionality, we locate the Xbox application, proceed to open it, and here in the upper navigation bar, we also conduct a search for Minecraft. By clicking here, we are presented with the available option to install install the launcher or Minecraft itself. The Bedrock Edition, which is also alternatively referred to as the Windows Edition, allows us to initiate Minecraft Bedrock Edition directly, bypassing the necessity for the launcher. As you are able to see, I have successfully opened it. If you do not have it installed, the installation process will simply commence initially, and it functions as well. As we can see, we are here. These were three ways to install Minecraft Bedrock. If the guide helped you, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It means a lot to me. I will be very grateful. Thanks, and see you next time.